Hi everyone, um, so I'm back with part two of week 15. Um, so this is pretty much Friday and Saturday my week. There will be a third part to this week because I wanted to include the photos from my sister-in-law's Hindu um, and I just had loads of those, so I wanted to include all of them. And I decided to use this pocket page with the 10 3 by 4s because I had a load of photos that I could use. Um, but this is a bit sad really because this is my last pocket page of this style. I um, am coming to the end of being able to use predominantly all my older pocket pages because a lot of them now that are left have the um, three by fours in landscape and the portrait six by fours and I find that they're quite hard to use in terms of collections because the cut parts tend to be the opposite way around um, so I do obviously need to have some pockets that have the three by fours um, in the portrait and the six by fours in the landscape so I will have to actually open my pack of um, pocket pages that I bought at the beginning or the end of last year for this year um, because that is predominantly design A's and I think is it design B's I'm not 100% sure but the ones that do have the three by fours and in the opposite way around um, but it just means that I've got the design A's for when I need to use you know this design um i will still be using obviously my older pocket pages i don't want to you know just ignore them completely um i want to include them but i just don't want to be restricted in terms of um what photos to take which way around and all that sort of jazz so yeah anyway so with this um week so the friday me and joe actually had the whole weekend off together and originally we didn't have that many plans um i had we had one plan and then that was to go down to London on the Monday and Tuesday, so you'll see that next week. Um, but then um, my, well, Joe's sister's Hindu ended up on the Saturday, and then we decided to meet friends on the Sunday, um, and then we decided to go out on the Friday, and then we decided to go out on the Sunday morning. So, yeah, we just had a load of plans, and so the weekend was so busy. Um, but the first photo you'll see at the top there um, is actually a picture of us um, not sleeping, but we just sort of woken up on the Friday morning. We didn't have to get up for work. It was very nice, and Moose came in for cuddles in between us, as he does. Um, so that was just a cute little photo that I thought I'd include. Um, and then I'm going to use that Spring Faves as my little journaling card to go in there. Um, the photos that I'm using at, in the middle are going to be pretty much of when we went out on the Friday. Um, so we actually went to the Coal Miner Museum, which I've seen all the time since I moved up here. I've, we've passed it so many times. And it's actually free um, to go. So we decided to go, and but we did decide to pay um, £5 each for the underground tour where you can actually go underneath underground and go and see the actual coal mines, which I thought was really interesting. So we did pay £10, which I thought was really, really good because it was like an hour and a half tour and it was really good. Um, so we paid for that and we just had a wander around and we had some lunch and things. It was just a nice little day out really. Uh, we did actually spend longer there than I thought we would. Um, but one of the photos there with the buff light on it, that is a picture of one of the um, storage sheds or you know the equipment sheds and things. Um, and then the pocket that's going to go next to that, I'm actually going to use the wristband as well as these little coin tokens that we got given. Um, we had to give over two for the tour, but then we got to keep these ones, which I thought was quite nice. They're quite heavy, they are metal, um, but I wanted to include them. So I'm gonna stick those at the top with the wristband down the side, and I'm gonna use the little space that's left over for some journaling. Um, but I did have to use some double-sided sticky tape, um, obviously to stick those down. Um, and then the last photo that's gonna go in there is actually a picture of us um, with the hard head, hard helmets, hard caps. Is that what they're called? I'm not too sure what they're called now, um, but with the helmets on, basically. And um, we had to wear those as we were going down. Um, it was a tour of about 10 people, um, but it was really, really interesting. It's a very big thing here up in Yorkshire um, for the coal mining. And as I said, it was it's a free um, attraction. And I just think it's something that, you know, people should know about. And um, it was doing an exhibition as well, so that's why we decided to go. And, um, yeah, we just had a nice sort of day out. But I wanted a picture of us with our little helmets on because I thought they were cute. So that is that line. And then the line that's going to go at the bottom is going to be about um, Joe's sister, my sister-in-law's Hindu, um, because I wanted to... I had so many photos of groups and stuff in the third pocket, third page that's going to come. Uh, but I didn't have any photos of like the stuff before it if that makes any sense um so i wanted to include um the 
the girls that organised it, um, they did some really, really nice little invites that they sent via WhatsApp. So I printed those off and it just had like the time and dates and everything. And it also had like the dress code and what to expect and, you know, that sort of thing. And it was just a really nice um, little gesture, I suppose, of having like a proper invite. Um, and it was um, ABBA themed, which was really fun. So everyone, you didn't have to fancy dress, but um, you could, you know, choose between whatever if you wanted to fancy dress or if you wanted to just wear like a, you know, ABBA or even like a Mamma Mia style outfit and things. But I decided on wear this pink um, sort of aztec -y dress um, that I've had for a while that I've just not worn. Um, it's a really nice dress. It's, you know, it's suitable for this time of year because it obviously wasn't that warm. Um, so I was able to have wear like a long sleeved um, dress for that, which I really enjoyed. So um, yeah, so I'm just going to put these invites in there. So I said, there's one that's just like an introductory sort of time dates, you know, um and like an introduction and then there's one with like instructions and stuff so I put them both in there um and then I'm going to use one of the cut parts to go in between and then I'm going to put a picture of me just before I left so Joe dropped me off um and it was a really really good day um it started around two I think but we all got there before uh the bride so that we could all set I actually helped set up because I was a little bit early as well um but it was really really good as I said it was ABBA themed so we had like big balloons and they had um like an ABBA tribute band and stuff like that so yeah it was really fun and I enjoyed that the only thing is obviously they did actually do um little bits and pieces like there were some sunglasses and little key rings but I can't include them in my project live because they're too bulky so I'm sort of holding on to them thinking where can I put them but I don't know what I'm going to do with them but I hope you've enjoyed this part and I'll be back with the third part shortly thank you very much bye